Boatloads of Rohingya families arrived at Cox's Bazaar in Bangladesh on Wednesday after fleeing violence in northern Myanmar. Nearly 150,000 refugees have crossed to neighbouring Bangladesh, fleeing a security sweep by Myanmar forces who have been torching villages in response to attacks by Rohingya militants on August 25th. <coughs> Newly arrived Rohingyas also told authorities that three boats carrying between them more than 100 people capsized in the early hours of Wednesday. Six bodies, including three children, had since washed ashore. Myanmar leader Aung San Suu Kyi has been accused of not speaking out for the minority that has long complained of persecution. Some have called for the Nobel Peace Prize she won in 1991 as a champion of democracy to be revoked. Suu Kyi, however, has the support of Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi, who said his country shared Myanmar's concern about extremist violence in Rakhine State. We would like to thank India particularly for the strong stand that has it has taken with regard to the ter terrorist tre threat that came to our country a couple of weeks ago. And uh, we believe that together we can work to make sure that terrorism is not allowed to take root on our soil or on the soil of our neighbouring countries. Last month, India said it wanted to deport about 40,000 Rohingya refugees who left Myanmar in previous years.